Hey, John and Eric here from Best of One Gaming. Uh, I'm here for some redemption, uh, as you saw in our last video. Uh, and if you haven't seen that, check out that in the description. Uh, Eric won against Brandon. Brandon defeated me. And what that means is if I win here today, well, then I'm the grand champion. That's how it works. Let's do this. <laughs> All right, we are back. Everything is open and ready to go. Uh, let's open these boxes and let's see who wins. We're gonna throw the point system up on the screen right now uh, so you know what we're counting, but the way these box battles work, if you haven't seen any of our previous videos, is the person who gets the best pulls gets the money pack. And the money pack is... Not the Zeno. The third pack from the bottom on the left-hand side. It is obviously the best. I got a shotgun pack over here. Yo, let's see what I get this time. Same pack as last time. Same pack as last time. Alright, my box stopper here was a SR. Not a bad SR to get. I actually need one of those. I got the Zeno. Always a good card. I'm gonna go with the left hand side. Left? Alright, I'll take the right side. Anyway. Let's start there. I'm gonna throw an extra pack for my right hand side in there because your left hand, right hand side is a little bit less or more than mine. Alrighty. Let's do this. Let's get cracking. So currently, I am still looking for one Seaforware. I am looking for that Grade 8 Mass Saiyan. Eric, what are you looking for out of the set? I still need some more yellow stuff, so... Like in the last video, I still need some of those uh, Chupacabras. And uh, a couple dormant legends would be nice. Still looking for a few of those. I just, I just realized I said dormant legends and it's dormant potential. <laughs> so. Yeah. I want to just like get a rip on a pack without it like tearing off. Just the perfect rip? Yeah, it's like the perfect rip. That's when you know it's going to be a secret rare. <laughs> That's when you get that perfect rip. You got a foil bono. Hmm. All right. Not looking good for either of us. So uh, no, I got a bunch of uh, nothing too shiny. No, I mean they're shiny. Everything in the set has uh, is shiny. I do like the full art. Yes. Uh, I don't. I don't even mind everything that's not foil anymore. Like. It's, it, they all look good, so it's, it's okay. It's honestly super easy to get a full... Yep. We got our first SR. We got the Goku. Rival Seeker. Heard that's a pretty good card. Everyone's on that uh, Invoker train. Well, when you can burn your opponent for six life, it's no interaction. Can't be too bad. Nah. Um, as I was saying, it's, it's, it's becoming easier and easier to foil out your deck with, uh, with commons and uncommons with these pull rates in this set. So every pack comes with either a foil rare, common, or uncommon, Trunks. and then an uncommon rare or something real good in the back. Yo, this is a great rare to pull. Yo, it's one of my favorite cards. Yeah. Being able to clear tokens and just clear everything up to six, I'm good with that. But then tokens don't cost anything. Frieza. I kind of peeked, so I'm a peeker. Oh, Mira. I like me some Mira. And we got a cell. Not bad. So you got both multicolor SRs in your oh, box. Yeah. Those are, those are going to be some good ones. Foil leader here. Brandon always says, if you sit down you don't have a foil leader, yep, what, are you, what are you doing with your life? <laughs> or something similar to that. <laughs> this is a lot of things, and I love every one of them. Foil Oolong and uh, the Doria, the counterplay on. I think I've had trouble pulling these actually. I don't even know if I have a place that was. I have not pulled a single SR Yo. on this side. So. It's looking good for me. I think I'm going to take the W. Uh, I don't know about that. <laughs> I'm feeling pretty confident today. I took a pretty hard loss on uh, the last box battle I was in. So, I'm real excited to, to get some redemption. Okay. 
How are you looking? How many packs you got left? Oh, what was that? I got a non-shiny right before my SPR. This happened to me when I opened some packs from Target. <laughs> so they like to play tricks on me so that Eric wins. Oh, yeah. Not saying that this was rigged, but uh, what are you doing, Bandai? Yo, guess who got a Gogeta SS4? Skr, check that out. It's yeah. looking beautiful. Monster. Man, we're ahead of the game today. Alright, alright, alright. Uh, this is not looking good for me. <laughs> <laughs> that was on the right side. Too. I think that's probably one of the uh, the best secret rares in this set. Yeah, it's pretty good. I've, through testing, we've kind of realized it's also kind of bad at the same time. So, yo, I got something Brandon would like. If you're not going for game with it, it becomes kind of a hindrance in your next turn because then you have a the whole ton of energy and can't play anything. So, unless you're drawing a lot, like your Toa deck does with all of her extra cards. Right, right. Let's go ahead and sleeve this up. Get a nice little thing fist here. I might be doing something similar to what Brandon did. He got an all red box pretty much. And it's looking pretty good for an all red box on my side here. <laughs> Honestly, we haven't really pulled much over here either, besides the scare. <laughs> <laughs> Got him. I gotta ask you a quick question, though. That pack you opened with a secret in it. Did you have a perfect rip? No. Nah. I'm going to keep track of that. No, nah, nah, I haven't been <laughs> ripping. I haven't been ripping well. Um, Doyle, some toe, pan. Ooh, um, that looks pretty good. And freeze it. Got a blue go tanks there. Nice. Are you on your other side of it? Yo, I, I definitely ripped through that pretty fast. Oh, I am too. Oh, perfect. Well, let's do this. We are in sync. All right, we got half a side left. It looks like Eric is in the lead with that secret rare call. Those secret rares are worth seven points. Yeah. Burn. Oh, we got a, another SR. We got Shenron. Pretty good. Probably one of the better red unison cards, if not the best. Some more red support over here. <laughs> Anyone else excited about this Yamcha? I think this game has needed burn support for a long time, and I think we got some here. I know, I love me some burn. We're also about a week out from the anniversary box here. Uh, we're recording this uh, July 29th. And the anniversary box comes out on August 7th, so... You guys want to see us open some of those boxes? Let us know down in the comments, uh, and we'll try to get some of those open for you too. Definitely the, like the reprints; those look solid. There's only like one or two that I'm not a huge fan of, but the rest of them look really great. Yo, first SPR for me? Oh yeah, Vegeta. This is probably one of my favorite looking ones, next to probably the Gogeta. I just pulled my second SPR. I got a nice Zeno here. Nice. This is probably one of my favorite. I am running this in my Gogeta Ram deck right now. Gogeta is always fun. I've always had fun playing Gogeta. And we were fortunate enough to go to the celebrations and get the Vecus early, so I, I could not play those. So we actually went to the Philly uh, celebrations back in February of last year. Another red card. It's right on both sides of the table today. <laughs> Oof. Oof. Watch those corners now. Yo. Got the rip. That's a perfect rip. Too bad we already pulled the scare. Oh. We got a little bunny girl action. Bunny girl action. She's a is a pretty good card. She's going for a decent chunk of change right now, too. 
What was that? Play two free cards, basically? You play her for free, and... And then you can play a... Earthling. Uh, red Earthling Omen battle card. So that's the first time they've really done that, where they've specified that it has to be Earthling only. So you can't utilize that to bring out a, a Gohan or a, or one of the half Saiyan, half Earthlings. Right. But there's a lot of Yamcha support in this deck. Yamcha's my boy. Zarbon and bring in Pet. Not right, too much I'm, coming, I'm coming down here. I got five packs left. <laughs> it's not looking good. I'm at. I'm opening fifth pack right now. All right. Although we all know that if I did have a skirt, it's right there. So uh, it'll be super awkward if I lose this and Eric gets both Man, secret rares. I'll be happy. I will be happy. Uh, we'll cut before the choice words. <laughs> <laughs> Accepted. The meter is not bad either. No, I think I think Green got a lot of support now. There's a lot of um, there's a lot of hand destruction stuff going out there, and, and that's what Green's always been known for. Right, and it's got removal too, so it's easy to keep up board state with while you're tearing their hand apart. Yeah. So close. All right, I'm gonna go for the perfect tear here. <coughs> this is gonna be a secret. Everybody watch this. You calling it? I'm calling this perfect tear, pretty. Oh. Oh. Uh, Oh. Yo. That was a nice tear. That's gonna be it. That's it. Hopefully it's not. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that, that looks pretty good. Frieza. Alright, John. Well, I'm hoping that your uh, your other SPR is. Yo, it's not. In the, the money pack, and then I pull a skur. Perfect. And then I win this. <laughs> That's can do it. That can that's be how it. you. That's how you redeem yourself. That's how you go from zero to hero, just like that. <laughs> Yo, I got two. Both of my favorite looking SPRs. I got those dreams are crushed, John. <laughs> that looks good. That's this is beautiful right here. Look at this. Oh, Leak Did he do it? I'm gonna hold this up for the camera first, so you guys get to see it before Eric does. And then you can just deal with that. Yo, <clears throat> it's looking good. We got two secret rares pulled here. Epic. How many packs you got left? I got one pack left. Sorry. I got one pack left too. Oh, you already pulled your other SR. Yeah. Yo, these boxes are fire. Yo, this is gonna be close. Yes. It's gonna be a close one. It's gonna come down to rares and uncommons. uncommons. All right, here we go. Goten, Goku, Jiren, more Goku, the Ox King, Freeze, a lot of Vanillas there, the Janks, ooh, Mira, that's a good card to have foil, and nothing spectacular. Right? Oh, same. <laughs> all right, that is all of our packs here. Let us count these up, and we'll be right back to uh, let you guys know who won. It's going to be a close one, because... Scurs. Two scurs. Yeah, yeah, there it is. No throw. It. Game over. <laughs> All right, we are back, and as you can see, we have everything lined up here on the table and tallied up. Uh, if you were keeping along with the video and the points, uh, you will know that today was a tie. So we're going to have to go down to a tiebreaker. Now, the way the tiebreakers work is we're both going to open the money pack, and whoever gets the better pulls in the money pack. Uh, gets the other person's pack. Uh, if it is both a tie there, we'll let you know. So stay tuned. Okay. Here we go. Perfect uh, rip. Uh, no, oh, no, that was a bad rip. I don't know about you, but I'm going to slow roll this one. Alrighty. Alright. Got some Time Bullet, a Broly, Vegeta, my Zamasu, Piccolo, my Galu, Trunks, Jace, Matt, my foil. We got Frieza. Is it a common or uncommon? It is a uncommon, sir. Oh, so is mine. Ooh, Poutine. Is... All right, what do you got? Ah, ah. double tie. Jeez, <clears throat> both those poles were. Yeah. Ooh. Well, we both got SCR. So. Yeah, so we can't. I can't, we'll I can't complain that much. Uh, so now we leave it up to you guys. Uh, who do you think got the better poles? Uh, let us know down in those comments, and uh, that'll be the winner of this, and the obviously the grand champion of our Rise of the Unison Warriors 
pack battles. Alright, that's going to do it for us today. If you liked the video, don't forget to hit that like button. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe. And if you want to see more videos like this, let us know down in the comments.